Hey, what is up team? Josh, Shannon, and Melissa. I wish there was some way where we can get together and have a little meeting from time to time, but uh, with our crazy schedules, I know it's it's kind of impossible, but you know, getting information to you guys um, this way is just as just as uh, just as well. Um, but I want to just remind you guys a couple things as um, Commit to Fit is here. What does that mean for us, the trainers? Um, so I think I really believe we have two different scenarios here. Um, the Trinity location, Josh, Melissa, you guys are going to experience more of an influx of new people that are actually stepping into the doors to, you know, to get their workouts in. Uh, unlike Spring Hill, for us, we have kind of narrowed it down to where we have maybe 20, 30, 40 of the 150 signups are new. So we're only expecting 20 to 40 brand new people that have not stepped foot into the facility out of 150. That's not a lot, but I think with Trinity, Josh and Melissa, you guys are going to have more, more newbies coming through the door. So really, what does it all mean? And how does it, how does, how does our role uh, play effect on, on, on C2F? Um, so just remember the new people, it's going to be fast and furious. Um, hold your BAs accountable, know who your, your new people are that are coming in and just do as we always do. We, we baby the crap out of them, right? Um, our patient's level has to get uh, a little more, you know, defining, I know, because they're new, right? Shannon. Sorry, Shannon. You know I had to do that. So we have to be a little bit more patient. Remember, we have to practice our empathy and our compassion, right? Um, and just wow the shit out of these new people, you know. In the end, they come back and they, and they train and they, under us, they love, they fall in love with you. Uh, yeah, they could fall in love with the BAs and the system and everything, but in the end, we're the final nail in in in, in the in the coffin, as you would say, and and that's gonna get them as a member, right? So uh, we have to step up our game, uh, and we have to keep an eye on our existing clients, right? We have to make sure that their game is 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 getting stepped up, and we're modding them accordingly. Um, so it's gonna be a busy six weeks for us especially the first two weeks. So just refocus yourself, take a look in the mirror, um, self-reflect and decide what, you know, how you're going to attack all these new clients and, and just wow the crap out of them and, and get them on the, the burn way, right? I was thinking of some ways to make our life a little easier as we train them. Uh, and one thing I was doing was, as of late, is... I've had, I don't know, four, five, six, seven people brand new all at once. And just the way that the, pro, the, you know, the stations and the programming was working, I would put them all together, all of them, all the new people together so I could train and mod them in one area instead of running around the room trying to train a new person here or a new person there, three new people over here. So if you group your new people together, uh, not to partner up, but group them together with some veterans that are going to help them. You're able to see all those new people all in one shot. This may work, may not work for you. If you want to use something else, I just found it a little bit easier. Um, just to see and just to give the attention to the new people if they're all together. Um, the only the only negative I could see is that maybe spending too much time in that station with you know because if you have six people. New people, you're you're there a little bit longer, maybe fixing six people. I don't know. I don't know. Play with it. See how it works for you. Uh, that's the route I'm gonna take. I'm gonna I'm gonna lump my uh, my new people all together and um, just make it easy for ourselves. So that's basically all I have, guys. Um, just wow them. Be who you are. Be show them why we're the best. Uh, be patient, Shannon. Um, 
and just just be you know yourself and and just just continue the wow wow them okay ask lean on your BAs get the help know their names high fives let's just show them let's just give them what we got do as we always do and um, we'll grow that that membership base then and down there in Trinity okay guys so uh, that's all I got any questions just hit me up on this or just you know you could always ask um, let's go get them C2F is here have a great day tomorrow Let's rebound with some good story. What was that? Five minutes and 34 seconds. That's shorter than a Josh video. Oh, oh. It's okay, Josh. It's all good, bro. It's all good. Thanks, guys. I appreciate you. Take care. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.